Hi everybody, how are you all doing? In the last video, we saw a bit about SARS and rulers of Russia and formation of USSR. Let us proceed further in this video. From 1989, conflicts developed between the parliament of the USSR and those of the individual republics. The individual republics were fighting mainly over the respective powers of the center. At that time, it still was the USSR government and the republics. These conflicts multiplied and grew more and more by the resurgence of ethnic nationalism and increasing demands for autonomy. They even wanted for full independence from the clutches of USSR. By December 1991, the Union of Soviet Socialist Republics had virtually ceased to exist. The future of its territories and people were, was uncertain. Three republics in particular, they are Estonia, Latvia and Lithuania, had achieved complete independence and were internationally recognized as sovereign states. And at that time, several others were demanding independence. Mikhail Gorbachev was the president of the Soviet Union at that time. He made sincere and serious attempts to establish a new union of sovereign states. But the agreement among the remaining 12 republics was not achieved. They were more concerned about independence and wanted to break away totally from the former Soviet Union. They simply discarded their legal position with the center authority of Soviet Union. These several Union Republics had begun to act as if they were sovereign states. They were negotiating with each other. Soviet Union and its powers had become a very small remnant of something that was once greater, more noticeable and more powerful. These republics completely bypassed the central government. There were three important and powerful republics called the Slav republics. They were Russia, Ukraine and Belarus. They wanted to establish a common bond between them and wanted to remain united but independent from other republics. On December 8, 1991, this process culminated by the signing of an agreement between the three Slav republics of Russia, Ukraine and Belarus. That agreement was for the establishment of the Commonwealth of Independent States. The important and crucial aspect of the government agreement was that they had agreed to a common policy for foreign affairs and defense most importantly in military affairs днём великой победы ура Let's end this part of video here. We shall see other important aspects that led to present war started by Putin and Russia in the next video. Thanks for watching the video till the end. 
I hope that you all liked the video. Please like, comment, subscribe and most importantly share the video to all your friends and family. Bye for now. Take care.